Hello and uh, welcome to a new video. In this one I'm gonna talk to you about uh, something really interesting. It's a web-based uh, GUI for Linux and uh, especially if you're uh, new to Linux you can uh, find it uh, quite handy. Uh, here you can see that uh, there are some pictures on the official website And uh, you can uh, integrate it with uh, different uh, APIs or different uh, applications. The installation you can find it in the documentation. And uh, it's uh, quite easy to set it up. Before we take a deep dive into the installation process and um, showing you how the GUI looks like, I would like to tell you that uh, only 2.1% uh, of you uh, watching these videos, they are subscribed to the channel. So if you want uh, to support the channel, uh, please share, subscribe and uh, like the video. Before we start the installation, we will um, actually have to update our system. Then uh, we will install the application itself. And right now we will uh, check the status to see if it's uh, loaded or not. And as you can see, we will uh, have to start it uh, manually. And right now it uh, becomes active. Now we will uh, check the IP address of uh, our server. And uh, we will gonna go to a web browser. Um, you will have to type in your um, address and then uh, call in 1990 for the port and right now we will use our username and password to log in uh, you can see the health the usage for memory cpu some kind of system information and uh, configuration about it on the left side you can also see the logs with uh, all the events that uh, happen then uh, we have the storage uh, after that uh, we will um, go to networking Then you can uh, see the accounts. You can also create a new account. Uh, the services afterwards, uh, which are running on the machine. and some applications. We already have the storage application in here. Uh, 
then we have a, an option for the software updates and uh, you can see what kind of uh, updates are listed and can be installed and um, You also have the possibility uh, to go in the terminal and uh, use it. So that's pretty much uh, about Cockpit. Try to install it, play with it, and uh, I hope you're gonna have some fun.